Meet the boy for me it was important. I feel the boy very uh, emotional, not just to meet Martunis, but to meet the families who lost, survive. It was nine, I don't remember how many days, uh, in the water in, uh, and see all the bodies dead pass next to him. Can you talk a little bit about your, your charity that you do? Well, we do it that um, every time. Uh, it's something that we, me and my, the people who are working with me, they always uh, give me good advices. And um, I think it's very important in general uh, to do this kind of stuff because, you know, um, it's, not, it's not about the image to be good, to have a good image, but it's to help the other ones. And I think it's, it's, it's important, in my opinion, it's very important. Um, and we, we always do that. And uh, it's something that is good. Uh, it's good for me because since when I was, when I was young, um, I always learned if you give, the God going to give you the double. So this is what's happened in my life. Um, since I started to do that, everything in my life become better and better. So I will still carry on to do that because I think it's, it's important and I feel good when I do that. The story about uh, Martinez is an incredible story. And ah, the boy. Something you are so proud of. Can you talk to me a little bit about that? Well, it was in 2004, tsunami. Uh, in Indonesia. Well, it was an amazing story. I don't remember 100% the, all, the, all the process, but I remember this, the boy. Uh, he survived. It was nine, I don't remember how many days, uh, in the water in, uh, and see all the bodies dead pass next to him. And he lost his mom, he lost uh, his sisters and it was an incredible story. I meet him, I meet him there um, in the same year. I was there to see the, the country and I, I didn't believe it, uh, what I saw. Uh, it was, the water devast everything. So it was, they, they don't exist nothing. Uh, so, and to meet the boy for me, it was important. I feel the boy very uh, emotional and uh, it was a fantastic experience um, to see uh, how the life is, the real life, you know, not super superficial life, you know, to have money, to have cars, to have this and that. To see the other point of the life, you know, the people who don't have nothing, the people who is poor, and, and I was poor before, so I know, and I, and I appreciate uh, these people, um, and it was, one of the, the days more emotional for myself too. Not just to meet Martunis, but to meet the families who lost uh, our, their families. You know, they lost the house. And when they saw me, they were so, so, so happy. And, and for me, it was an unbelievable journey. Number 17, it was my shirt, 17. And uh, coincidence, it was beautiful, I, you know. Uh, I meet his dad too. I invite them to come into Portugal to watch uh, a Portuguese game, a national team. Uh, beautiful story. Uh, maybe having that shirt might have given them some extra strength. To make of course, not just for me, but in general, for all the people, I think it's, uh, it's something that makes you feel like, wow, this has happened with this boy and he's with a smile in his face after to lose his mom and his, his uh, daughter. For me, it was a fantastic surprise, and of course, you always learn something about that. Not just in this case in particular, but for example, when you go to the hospitals, hospitals when you see a sick uh, people, a sick kids. You know, I have a kids. For me, it was a, a great experience, and and that inspiring me. You know, to be a, a better person, a better father, and I like it. It's hard when you go in this kind of places to see diseases people. But this is giving you after a different perspective of life. And for me, that is very important.